Once grown and mature, red blood cells stay in the blood. White blood cells may also be found in the bloodstream, but they may be more prevalent at other sites. For instance, lymphocytes are far more common and numerous in the lymphatic system than in the blood. 1. White blood cells, leukocytes, these include lymphocytes, monocytes and polymorphonuclear white cells that provide our bodies with protection from infection. White blood cells are key components of our immune system that help destroy invaders using a variety of tactics, including the production of antibodies that stick to the invaders. Problems with white blood cells can lead to infection. 2. Red blood cells, erythrocytes, these cells contain the hemoglobin that gives your blood its red color and carries oxygen to the cells and tissues in your body. Deficiency of red blood cells can lead to anemia, with symptoms such as fatigue, weakness, and intolerance to exercise. 3. Platelets, megakaryocytes and the bone marrow are the monster cells, they are large compared to others, that produce little packages of cellular material, platelets, that help control bleeding after an injury. Platelet deficiencies can lead to easy bruising and trouble with bleeding, 